the boss. Just use one of those bottles on everyone and then have damage. We're planning evacuation routes. We need to be ready if the Calamity or Demon show up in town. When the Calamity Hi, attacked I'm, the I'm first Calamity. time, there was massive confusion. Some children got hurt in all the madness. We're preparing evacuation boats so that we can all flee out to the sea if anything happens. It's a good oh. idea, but it will be hard to evacuate the entire town by boat. You'd best prepare a land route, too. That's a good point. But wouldn't a land route run the risk of being attacked by demons? Yes. You'll need to guard it as heavily as you do the city gates. It would be best if you could devise a way to prevent demons from intercepting the escape route, but... Hmm. Some of the exorcists lost use of their malachim. Just some? We can't count on the Abbey's garrison to help us. I'll send a request for aid to the Abbey. But please, don't give up. Try to think of something. Of course. There's no way we'll give up. You can't rely on someone else to protect you. Can you really ask the Abbey for help? I can send a Sylph to some of my old friends from when I was still in training. Even if they refuse to trust a traitor like me, they won't ignore the plight of the people here in Helibis. Eh, uh, you'd hope. That's what you would hope. This person. Hey! How long are you going to sit there crying? You can't be a fisherman if you're afraid of some lord of calamity. The demons that wrecked this town are still alive. Who knows when they'll show up again? How about right now? Stable <laughs> idiot! Keep whining like that, and this calamity whatever will keep walking all over you! But what can Hi. we do? We can't even defeat a single demon. That's why we take our boats, catch some fish, and make sure we've got enough food to keep on surviving. Hey, he's not wrong. Turn anything into that fool head of yours in school? Ugh. Do I have to knock some sense into you? Get up and get the boat ready. That is one hot-headed dad. Too hot for any demons to get near. That's for <laughs> sure. Oh, that's great. Like, I don't blame them. Like, it, it, you definitely need to prepare for the worst. Welcome back. I take it you defeated the Legates. Yes, but that still leaves Enominot and the Shepherd. Let's Onward go. go to the last battle. Oh, I picked up something nice for you. Here. Really? An apple? An Yo. apple? It's a fortune apple. A good luck charm. No real powers, but they're hard to find. Legend has it, they're pretty lucky. I'll take it. A I need all the luck I can apple. get. Hmm. But we're the bad guys, aren't we? Maybe what we need is bad luck instead. I think the Reaper's got that covered. Aw, that's just mean. <laughs> well, I appreciate the thought. Thanks, Benwick. I love apples. Just don't eat it. I couldn't eat it, even if I wanted. Wait a moment. That's right. My power to consume is a part of Enominot. If that's true, then... What is it? You want a bite? Delicious fortune apple. No way. That's a good luck charm. <laughs> that it is. One to give you the courage you need to survive. Uh. So, where's our final destination? The Empyrean's throne. Sail for Port Zexon. Yeah. Aye, aye, ma'am. Aye, aye, sir. Go. Got places to be. Do you think that with the Nominot's power waning, people will be free again? Well, the pirates are acting like pirates again. May take longer for others, but I think it's happening. What do you think of traveling around to see for ourselves? I'd like to know what's going on out there. Yo. I'd like to meet the Elemental Empyreans, if I could. That's not a great idea. They're all in various Earth Pulse points, but where those are is a mystery. They could be very far off. And they might not I view just want to go allies. defeat Inominat. Gods live by their own rules. Our business with Inominat probably doesn't concern them. You're right. It might be wise to scope out the situation before our battle. Now As let's we just go, go around, we might find out more about what Artorius is up to. Just don't need or it. Go. We could just go and, and do it, you know? I won't. Don't worry. Alright. 
Port Sexton, let's go. We will win. So, what was it you needed to say to me alone? Where's Luffy set? He wanted to stand watch with me, but I forced him to get some rest. After all this fighting, he needs it. I owe you. That kid always tries to play the tough guy. So what's your plan? Just like the one who named him. He's nothing like me. His motivation comes from hope. Hope. The wind is nice. Yes, the world may teem with hardship and sadness, but it's also filled with beauty. The endless ocean, the islands in the south, even the frozen tundra and the mountains that spew fire. It is. And humans make their home among all that beauty. This is the world that Luffy always yearned to travel. So I finally understand what he saw game plan. when he sat looking out over the ocean. Eleanor, I have a single favor to ask of you. If anything happens to me, take care of Luffy said. What? Is something the matter? The power possessed by the Therians and Inominat is fundamentally the same. I have a theory. No. Theory is too rational. A different part of me, something separate from my hatred, wants me to do something. It wants me to leave this world with hope. Wait. You don't mean... <laughs> Humor me, okay? If the worst happens, I'm counting on you. I understand. You have my word. I'll look after Lafayette. Oh my god, I want to know what's going to happen. Well, I'd love to take advantage of this momentary weakness. I can't. My oath is to obey your orders until my dying breath. <laughs> I'd almost forgotten about all that. Good thing I kicked your butt after all. <laughs> I'm so antsy to go into the castle and see well, what happens. The suppression field is gone. And in its place, rampaging demons. We expected that. Thanks. For everything. I only did what I felt like doing. Who needs thanks for that? Let's go. We have a fight yes. to finish with the shepherd. Go. Let's do this. Oh, more conversations. You know, Minot's power may have weakened, but I think that will only cause more of a stir in the cities. Without the Abbey's exorcists, the people will have a hard time quelling demons. Are you crying? I'm simply coming to terms with reality. I've learned to think for myself rather than let others do the thinking for me. It's painful and frightening, and comes with great responsibility. But this yeah, is much. who I am now. It's on me to own up, face my fears, and keep moving forward. Yes, You're let's a do piece it. piece of work. But I don't mind having you around. <laughs> Yes. I'm not weak like I used to be. No. You aren't. You don't have to bear the weight of the world alone, though. I understand that. Be I work. will do only what I can. You always say that, but then you end up overdoing it, right? If you push yourself to the limit and it's still not enough, there's no shame in relying on others. Brokuro, thank you so much. You realize you just thanked a demon, right? I'm aware of that. <laughs> okay. Carol, well, let's talk to all the other people. Exclamation marks. Hi. We put all Go our on. faith in you because you said you could protect us. We endured all your harsh rules and laws. So how can you tell us you can't defeat the demons because you can't control Malakim anymore? 
We don't understand why we've lost the ability to control our Malachim. But even yeah. without my Malak arts, yeah. I will fight to my dying breath to protect all of you. So please, calm down. Huh. I'm not listening to anything the Abbey says anymore. What are you yeah. looking at? Yeah, you there. Mean looking guy. Get over here. I think I'll pass. Thanks. Hey, muscles! Get back here! I'm not through with you! <laughs> please stop. I understand that you're worried and upset. Yeah, good luck with that now one. now isn't the time to be fighting amongst ourselves. Please, let us all stand together. Help us fight off the madness and the demons that threaten our world. <sighs> and if that's not good enough for you, you can face me instead. Guess I'm sorry. That exorcist has some serious yes. backbone. Aye. Yeah, I, I like that guy. So. Hey, it's, it's you! Uh, Margilou's debauchery. It's Menagerie. Yeah. <laughs> I finally get a chance to oh see God. the famous Mogilu's Menagerie. I've been waiting forever to meet up with you again. Meet up with us? Why? Well, with my bad luck, I've always just missed out on seeing your splendiferous performances. So, well, I made my own Menagerie. The Abbey okay. is a mess. And people everywhere are scared. Demons abound and, well, everyone's so gloomy. <laughs> so I thought that this is exactly the time when people need something fun and happy to lift their spirits. My troop is still in training, but we're almost ready. That's wonderful. That's cool. What do you call yourselves? I wanted something with power. Impact. Uh oh. So behold, we are the Dark Wings. Dark Wings. Huh. Hey, okay. what gives? That's a terrible reaction. You're trying to cheer people up, right? So why dark? And dark wings only make me picture crows. Or bats, maybe. Really? Yeah. When I think of the dark wings, I think comedy. Hmm. Maybe I should rethink this. Oh, I yeah, got maybe. It. We'll be the dark smiles. Hmm. Oh. Sounds like you've got a pretty dark sense of humor. You really want to go with such a dark-hearted name? Okay, fine. The dark magic. No, the dark circus. No, no, that's no good. The darkest hour. The dark... Maybe you could try losing the dark part. Hmm, good point. All right, then. <laughs> How about this one? The Peddlers of Joy. We don't accept solicitations. <sighs> fine, fine. Forget you. I <laughs> made my decision. We're Dark Wing Menagerie of Comedy. And that's final. You really went all out. Still, you got zing, kid. My Here's God. Here's with many dark years to come. Magic Kazam! Thanks. That makes us rivals now, but still, from one entertainer to another, good luck. About that Magic Kazam of yours? You only use that spell when you couldn't care less what happens, right? What this world about. needs now is a good dose of apathy. Am I right? But here's <laughs> hoping you have many dark years to come. That's not very nice at all, is it? Magic Kazam! God, this is horrible. All right, so we have one more person to talk to down here. Then we can figure out where to go. Hello, how you doing? I can't get my hands on nectar or a good drink anymore, but thanks to that, I've finally seen the light. I tried drinking okay. lots of different things to help cope with my cravings, and I discovered that a nice cup of tea really does the trick. You can't he give is awesome. kids the heavy stuff, but tea, kids, adults, the elderly. Everyone can enjoy it. <laughs> hey, Jake. Point of view. I'm thinking about using my life savings to oh open my gosh, a tea so shop cute. filled with tea from all over the world. Rather than How let you ourselves doing? get all worked up panicking over the demons, we'd be better off sitting down with a nice cup of relaxing tea. It'd be wonderful if you sold some tasty pies or cookies there, too. I know, yeah. right? I need to find some baked goods that go well with Aww. tea. Yeah, Maybe I, I can find better. a girlfriend while I'm at it. Well, yeah, I'm good like. Luck with that. Thanks. Speaking I don't know. Which, I'm, I feel like I'm single? getting sick again. Sorry, I think I'll pass. <sighs> yeah. I just want to go lay much. down and pass out and try to sleep this off. But yeah, we're almost done with the game. Scout Trying to finish it today. Like we're we're about to go to the last area. So yeah. Well, that's good. 
All right, so I need to go north. Away. I'm gonna go to the east then. I need to go, but yeah. We're literally about to go fight the final boss of the game, so I'm excited. The story. This game is so freaking good. Like, I know you missed a lot of the story while I was streaming it, but oh my god. Freaking amazing. You really need to play through it. So there it is, Empyrean's Throne. Oh my god! We're almost there! I can't wait to see how this game ends. It's definitely been a pretty crazy roller coaster of emotions and plot thickening and stiff. I can feel him. You know me not somewhere in the sky. In the sky? Wait, look! The sky, huh? Station mark over here. I'm gonna come here first and then go inside. I really hope that we don't have to do like a billion things inside to get to the boss. Because the Tales series is definitely big on making you go through the final dungeon and it takes a while to get there, so we'll see. Yeah, Death texted me saying that when he gets home, he and a few friends are gonna um, play some PoE, and he's planning on grinding all day. So after I'm done beating this game, I need to figure out some food, and then I get to do whatever I want because it's gonna be just me. You're the ones who liberated us from Inominat's domain, right? I want to thank you for all that you've done. You I'm really hungry. don't have to do that. I was just acting. I had spaghettios the other day. <laughs> if any molecules still get in my way, I won't hesitate to devour them. Hey, hold up! Most of us are under the influence of Inominat's power and have been robbed of our free will. The majority of Malakim are too afraid of malevolence to even go near humans. Before Inominat's interference, we were a peaceful people. That doesn't matter to me. We get what you're saying, but if we go easy on anybody, then we'll be the ones who get killed. If you truly want to protect your friends, you'll have to stop us by force. Uh, yep. Wouldn't you agree that having free will means choosing the path you believe in? I suppose you're right. And that's why we too will work toward the future we desire. In order to achieve a perfect fusion of human and Moloch power, the Abbey gave Armadi a physical form. Specifically, their vessels embedded with a formula that can manipulate mana. They call these objects divine artifacts. Is that what that bow is? Yes, this is one of the divine artifacts. We've decided we want to pass on the knowledge behind the divine artifacts and armatization to future generations. Yeah, this carries on to Tales that? of Zestiria. Armatization is dangerous. We want to enable humans and Malakim to coexist. What? In its current form, armatization is a one-sided process, allowing a human to exploit a Moloch's power. But imagine if humans and Malakim could armatize with mutual awareness and consent. It could provide just the edge our people need to battle the great forces who seek to harm our world. Like yep. the Lord of Calamity, you mean? Well, do what you want. It's another potential for the future. Yes. But I have one warning for you. The divine artifact intended for Inominat is already complete. You know what that means, don't you? Artorius himself will use the divine artifact to armatize with the Nominat. For the good of the yeah. future, we'll pray for your success in battle, Lord of Calamity. 
I thank you. I will be victorious. Hopefully. I really, really, really hope I can pull this off. Alright. In we go. I just really hope that it doesn't take like five hours to get through this place. I just want to go and defeat him and be happy and see what happens. And stuff. Yeah, uh, this game is definitely my favorite Tales game. It is so good. I, I, I liked Zysteria a lot, and I liked Symphonia, but this one is amazing. Alright, up the billion stairs we go. Nice that we've tracked down to Nominat, but uh, now what's the plan? <laughs> I don't think even Griffin could get us up there. And my guardian takes one passenger only. I don't think we need to worry about that. Huh? Well, looky there. A teleportation art. Looks like we are expected. Of course. For you know me not to fully awaken. They need me and Lafayette, which means they want to settle this once and for all too. And we will win. I think. I Bring hope. it on. Is what reckless idiots say before plunging into the unknown. Be more cautious. <laughs> Sorry. Wow, that is the first time I've ever heard Magilu say something sensible. Oh my God, a bad omen. Let's be careful and take a good look around first. Belittling a faithful ally right before the final showdown? Do you not cry? If I prick you, do you not bleed? My god. Can we just go? <sighs> Deep breaths. And like another save point. I'm going over there first. Okay. I was gonna say, the like, oh, they won't let me? What? I don't know what to expect, so I want all the saves I can get. Now to teleport and see what happens. I hope we can do this. I'm scared. No exorcists here, it looks like. But a whole lot of Malachim. These Malachim are the sublords who have packs directly with Inominat. Be careful. Ah, okay. He's likely given them a share of his power. In other so, words, that means trouble. good XP. Not at all. We'll just whip out our knives and carve a path. Alright. So, yeah, that's what I thought. It is a huge. Down. Our path now leads to the Imperial All right, yeah. Not and Artorius. Um, a strange feeling. Yeah, it's not That's every not day you make today. an enemy of the entire world and Emmet. head out to cut down a god. That is certainly true. That but sucks. what surprises me more is the passion that fills me. Yeah, you're leaps and bounds more stubborn and willful than any of us. I'll take that as a compliment. If you weren't, hey. I don't think you'd have been able to make a pact with Lafayette. Seth. It's because of you, Eleanor, that I've been able to take this voyage around the world. You have my thanks. I also wish to offer my thanks. And look at you, kiddo. Despite the unfortunate company you've chosen to keep, you've managed to grow into a fine young man. Good <laughs> on you. It's true, isn't it? It kind of makes me want to give myself a pat on the back. <laughs> you said it, kid. Velvet gave me a name? Thanks and for your Eleanor support. became my vessel. Hey, Chef. Thanks Aizen for the host. And Rokuro taught me how to live. And Magilu provided lots of surprises and laughs. 
All of that made me who I am now. And I'm glad for it. What about me? Didn't I do something for you? Grim no, not at all. The ancient tongue. And the Enthu... <laughs> Thanks for the sparks. Yes, you're mean. <laughs> I'm Thanks kidding. for the love. The Enfu taught Oh, thank you for the follow. To never be discouraged. I think. Black beer. Oh my god. Thanks for your support. Oh, well. <laughs> Seems the Thank you guys so much for the host. Our spirits. We don't know what's ahead. Stay sharp. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. A llama. Is it a llama? I don't even know. But that taco. The god. How is everyone? Guess it's time to fight. <laughs> thank you the love. Guys, thank you so much. I hope you're doing good. Yeah, we're actually near the end of the game. Like we're in the last zone. But I found out that it's just like way too long right now. So yeah, we'll have to do it another time. <laughs> I'm actually getting kind of hungry, so soon I'm gonna go step away and get some food. Once I make it to the next save point, I could go for some tacos. Tacos would be nice. Okay, I'll, I'll be over there in like what ten hours, maybe, maybe more. Twelve hours. All right. I'll see you in twelve hours. Yeah, this is Tales of the Zuria, and it's actually a really good game. I, I love the story. It it's one of my favorite um, Tales games. You're not hurt, are you? No, I'm fine. I got talk about this, and I'm only two hours away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of tacos in my area, though. I, I could get tacos, like, you know. Ten minutes away. No, they're not your tacos, but I still don't have to make them, so... I... <laughs> now, I actually... I think I have taco stuff. I can make shrimp tacos. I, I have en enough stuff to make shrimp tacos. Oh my. The pork in your tacos? <laughs> well, I did just say shrimp, so no. So is it? It's just shrimp. Come here. Stop going away from me. Yeah, I'm so sad that this place is too big, though. Like, I am not about to break it at all. Can someone res me? Res. Alright, pal. Have a good one, and thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, but... Oh my god. Thanks, guys, for not healing me after you res me. Nobody wants to res me. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. I'll figure it out. Yeah, all I know is these dudes have a lot of health. And they hit like a great trap. Uh, it's gonna take a while to get through this. Too much work to get into a little hard, but. Oh my god, Shrimp is amazing. I love Shrimp. 
but I like pretty much all seafood, so. Let me some seafood. Oh my god, leave me alone, you damn bugs! I don't like this. No, this is a JRPG. It's just a single player Japanese role playing game. Yeah, Why, what did you think it was? <laughs> Yeah, Sword Art Online is a single player game too though, isn't it? Yeah, most of the Sword Art Online's are single player. But yeah, just a regular JRPG. They all have co-op and multiplayer, sing also single player. Oh, okay. I thought they were all- most of them were single player. <laughs> Something that it looks like I have to go hit. Oh. All right. All right, so now elevator has been activated. Next. I don't want to bite. Don't. Let me just pass, please. Thank you. Alright, next floor. Oh jeez. Oh, this place looks interesting. Oh my god, a save point. Perfect. <laughs> 